All right, the purpose of this video is to show you how to use Email Hunter, which has changed their name to Hunter, to harvest email addresses inside LinkedIn. First thing you want to do is go to hunter.io and create yourself an account. There's the, uh, the uh, URL, hunter.io. Now, if for any reason, um, after we get into this, if you have difficulty trying to figure out how to use Hunter, just click on the Help button, and um, in the uh, Find Answers box, just type LinkedIn. And that will load uh, all their LinkedIn help information. So, once you've set up Email Hunter, the other thing you want to do is install the Chrome extension. And there's the little icon for the Chrome extension. You'll notice I currently have the email, the free plan, which allows you to harvest 150 emails a month. They're very reasonable for um, significantly more. I don't remember what it is, but I've, I've basically built a, a big enough list for myself now. So once you've set up an email hunter account and installed the Chrome extension, then you want to go into LinkedIn and um, set up a search filter. Now, what I've done is in LinkedIn, I've created a search, and I'll just take you through the, the sequence real quickly. I'll start on the home page, click in the search box, click on the magnifying glass, and that will take you into the, uh, the search um, screen. Now, I'm going to search for, let's search for second and third degree um connections in the phoenix area and i'm going to look for um, folks in the computer software business there's not going to be too many of those that i haven't tracked down yet um oh i'm, I'm sorry um and now one other thing that i highly recommend that you do um, this is picking up anybody who works in those industries um, typically, what I'm going to want is folks who are CEOs, like this guy right here, Clayt Mask, um, who's the CEO of Infusionsoft. Um, you can't get that kind of filter with the free version of LinkedIn. You've got to get uh, Sales Navigator, but this will get this is will take you far enough to to uh, understand how to use um, Email Hunter. So. You're going to get these pages of people who meet your, your filter. You'll see at the top of the very first uh, account will be this box that says select all. I recommend that you do not do this because you're going to pick up email addresses for a lot of folks that you don't necessarily want. You want to do these one at a time. This is the way I recommend that you do it. First, click on the connect button. Customize your invitation. Do not use the default LinkedIn invitation. Your goal here is to create a connection, and just clicking on the default won't do it. I click on Add a Note, and I have created a customized, personalized message that I generally say Lauren, or I put the, the person's first name, and then put uh, the rest of my note. If you lead with their name, it's much, much better than leading with anything else because people recognize their own names and like to read it. So put their name in there, uh, copy paste your personal note, and then send the invitation. After you've done that, and only after you've done that, then click on the connect button. And I'm going to go ahead and do this one right here because that's actually somebody I'd like to have in my, uh, in my network. So I'll say, Ron, with your permission, blah, 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 I'm going to send invitation. So I'm going to click on this connect on the, the email hunter button. And once I click that first one, it opens this little window here. After I go through all 25, deciding which ones I want, which ones I don't, um, then you click on the find email addresses and save leads. Now, one last thing. On this screen right here, you've got the list that your emails will be saved to. You can set up um, any number of lists in Email Hunter. So since this is the first time I've done any email hunting in February, I'm going to create a new list called Software CEOs February 2017. So 
So I'm going to create that list. All right. So over here, I'm probably going to have to refresh this screen. Let's refresh the screen and see what I get. All right. So I want to send this guy an invitation. I want it to be in the... Yeah, shoot. I probably have to have that list set up before I get into um, uh, LinkedIn. <clears throat> so you'll, you'll figure that bit out. Oh, no, there it is. Sorry. That's where I want it to go. So I'm going to find email addresses. It's going to go through. And everybody that it can save, it'll indicate that. And at that point, you're done. Last... You go back into Email Hunter, you select bulk leads. I'm sorry, you select leads and it'll show you your lists. And there's my lead, Software CEOs. Um, shows you uh, his email address and then you can export that file to your computer. <coughs> Apologize for my voice this morning. Export that file to your computer. Um, verify the email addresses. Um, email Hunter does have a verification function, but um, I've never used it, frankly, because I trust Never Bounce. Um, if you want to try verifying through Email Hunter, feel free. I use Never Bounce. So that's basically the process. That's the sequence.